Hey, it's Danny from Conscious Calisthenics here. So a lot of people keep asking me in the comment section on the YouTube videos that I make for this channel, Conscious Calisthenics, how do I eat so many calories in one sitting with my one meal a day? Because many people are saying, in relation to that, that they can eat nowhere near as many calories as I can from what they've seen in my What I Eat In A Day videos. And if you haven't seen any, I recommend checking out the one that I put a link for here. So it's very, very simple how I do it and how you can do it over time as well. So say that you can eat around 1,500 calories, your one meal a day. What you do is slowly over time, just keep adding small amounts of calories. So the next time you eat, you could add 50 more calories and then the next time another 50 calories and slowly train your body over time to be able to eat larger quantities of food. Because if you just try and go from eating 1,500 calories to 3,000 calories, your body's not gonna be used to it, and your stomach is not gonna be nowhere near as big enough to actually hold that amount of food, and you're probably gonna feel crap because you're gonna be overeating. And I do not recommend overeating whatsoever because it does not make you feel good at all, and it has negative effects on your mental and physical health holistically. So it's all about slow and steady wins the race. People that do ultra runs, such as 100 kilometer runs or more, they didn't just start running these massive long ultra run events around the world overnight. They slowly started from running small amounts and then accreting that over time so their body could adapt and actually run really long distances. So yeah, just be patient and you can increase the amount of calories that you need to over time. And what I will say is not everyone needs to eat an abundance of calories like I do, which is around three to 4,000 calories per my one meal a day. We are all different and unique. So if you're finding that you feel good with the amount of calories that you're eating, and you easily can just eat one meal a day and not multiple meals a day, then stick to the amount of calories that you're eating. It's not a competition. You don't need to try and eat as many calories as me or more. So yeah, just listen to your body and its needs. And what I say is since yesterday, my body's having a desire to eat less calorie, which I will experiment with and see what happens. But if it doesn't work, then I will not continue to eat less calories and I'll go back to eating a lot more. So I'll keep you updated on my journey with decreasing the amount of calories that I'm eating in my one meal a day. And yeah, it may change for you over time as well. And depending on how much exercise that you've done the day before or on that day, how stressed out you've been, how much you slept, and many other different factors is going to change the amount of calories you need from day to day. So for me, I don't count my calories. I know estimately what I eat, but it can fluctuate from day to day. When I've been doing some really intense exercise and I've had a very busy day, I eat a lot more calories. And if the day before I didn't eat as many calories as I normally would, the next day I'm gonna add the extra calories on top of that one meal a day that I eat within that day. So yeah, we are always in a state of continual fluctuation. And what I'll say is I eat a plant-based vegan diet that is high in carbohydrates, the majority of the time is quite low in fat and low in protein as well. And this makes it, at least for me, to be able to eat an abundance of calories. Because what I find is, if I start eating very fatty food, I get fatted out really quickly, as I call it, which means I just feel really, really full from fat, but I've hardly got any calories whatsoever, so I can't eat an abundance of calories. So from my own personal experience, me actually having a lot of fat is not good for me at all, because yeah, it doesn't make me feel great, and it stops me from eating the abundance of calories that I need to be every single day with my one meal a day. So I actually can feel good throughout the day whilst I'm in a fasting state, have an abundance of energy, have my mind work to the best of its ability and have my mood being as optimal as possible and many other different amazing benefits that I get from fasting daily with my one meal a day journey. So yeah, that's it for this video. If you have any questions, leave them down below and I get back to you as soon as possible. If you like the video, like it down below, give us a thumbs up and please share this video with anyone that you think needs to learn about what I shared with you today in relation to eating more calories with your one meal a day. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button by clicking it down below to receive a lot more one meal a day informational videos from me on a regular basis, what I eat in a day videos, what I do in a day, 
calisthenics workout videos and many other videos to help you go in the direction of achieving the body that you desire, the fitness levels and the energy levels as well. So if those type of videos sound good, you make sure you click that subscribe button down below and you click the bell notification button next to the subscribe button. Otherwise YouTube will not notify you of when new videos are uploaded. And I have new ones coming almost every single day. So as always, stay fit, stay energetic, and go and get those gains. Peace.